Blessed be my lovelies and welcome back to the channel. Today is a really, really quick video. I think it's going to be quick. I have no idea. It's very different. This is just an update to my setup. So recently, I've begged my dad, basically. Not really begged him. I just asked him. Um, okay, what I did was I laid down what the situation was to him. So I said, I need a new keyboard and mouse. My mouse, like both of them have been the only ones that i've used since i got my pc and i got my pc in like 2015 so it's six years i've had these two devices keyboard and mouse um and i would just like pull them up to show you i don't know if i can actually because wires but maybe i'll be able to show you um you know what i've got my phone here I can just do picture in picture. That's what editing is. What the heck is this? Okay. Okay. Um, so my keyboard that I've had since, um, 2015, like I said, it's I buy power, same as my PC. So basically my PC came with mouse and keyboard. This is the mouse. Yeah. I've had them for six years. And as you can see in my, um, in, on my keyboard, I'm like the letters have rubbed off for some of the keys, uh, as it does usually um, because of the oils on your hands. It'll rub off over time, over use. My WASD keys specifically, you can actually see like grooves and grid marks in the actual keys because of how I hold. And like when I press, I don't press straight down. I press and like sort of you you see in the video like i do i stroke it i stroke the key when i press it i don't press down i stroke so you can see like the actual like line of how i stroke my keys when i press them basically and like you can see w e missing a s d missing c is missing n just came off recently um l i think that is yeah L is starting to come off. Every other key is pretty decent, but the keys I use the most because I game are missing and it's about time I replace my piece, my keyboard. It works perfectly fine, um, but it's six years and I kind of want to use it to do keycaps, custom keycaps, uh, but only for this one. Uh, like for this style of keys because the new keyboard that i have that's sitting right here is oh it's so nice it's so nice i took a peek when i got it today it's so nice um my mouse it's on its way out when i say it's on its way out i mean it could be it's where it is right now and i can move it in a circle and it won't register I have to physically pick it up and put it back down and then move it again for it to like register that it's supposed to be doing its job. Um, sometimes the clicks don't work anymore. Uh, sometimes the scroll, like the scroll wheel was bugging out a couple weeks ago. And that's what made me want to get a new mouse in the first place because the sc scrolling was a nightmare. And when you play games like Genshin, where you have a lot of menus to scroll through, when you play games like stardew valley where you use your scroll wheel to go through your inventory minecraft scroll wheel to go through your inventory um when you're just reading stuff online scrolling through stuff online your scroll wheel is important and if it doesn't work or it jumps and it oh it was getting so frustrating i was like dad please <laughs> please <laughs> so that's what i did so today i'm going to be showing you first of all the mouse and keyboard before i install them as in like plug them into my computer um i'm gonna be showing you those first and then i'm going to install them because they're rgb <laughs> they're rgb <laughs> I can't believe it. They're RGB. Oh my god. So I'm going to show you the um, packaging first. I have to. Okay. Yeah. I have to look. You can barely see it. I'm going to just take a video with it on my phone because this is ridiculous. So this is the mouse that I'm getting. It's the Bengu 
getting that I have. Bangu Gaming Mouse, seven color LED flashing lights, plug and play. It's RGB and it's so pretty. It's, 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 it's claw-like, if that makes sense. So I'm going to see if I can open this with one hand. I'm now holding the camera with my left hand. I'm right-handed. This is going to end well. And it's really simple. The packaging is really simple. Absolutely simple. It do just pop out right here. Okay. There's paper. Cable. Braided wire. Love that. DPI. Button. Number of buttons. Colorful flashing lights. XB7. That's how it looks. It's so cool. But I got the black one. You could get it in white, but I got black because white and me? I'm a messy person. White is not a good idea. Look at it. Oh, it's so pretty. Compared to this thing. Look at that. Oh, I love this. It lights up. And the scroll wheel is pretty nice as well. Um, there's a lot of wires crossing, I think, right now. So my audio, my audio might be a bit messed up simply because I've got so many wires crossing. I have, I'm going to have to reconfigure anyways when I go back there to plug these in. But, oh, that's beautiful. I can't wait to plug it in and see it. Now, the keyboard that I got. Oh my god, the keyboard that I got. I really wanted a typewriter keyboard. But not one that looks like a typewriter, one that has like the keys and the sound. So let me just get this out. It's got green switches in color black and rainbow light. And it's by E Yusu Yuso. E Yuso. The K six hundred mechanical keyboard. Oh, you can hear it already. out <laughs> bubble wrap is so thick there we go into recycling with you oh, okay when you're done the user guide oh look at that oh cool okay so so on my current uh on my current keyboard, I've got hotkeys up at the very top that let me do a bunch of stuff. Uh, these hotkeys. So this is my computer. So this pulls up like um, this pulls up this PC when you press it. And then we've got Home, which pulls up a new tab in Google Chrome. I did not know you did that. Excuse me. It's not even a new tab. It's a whole new window. Since when? Oh my god. <laughs> then mail obviously search uh favorite i think calculator and then the media player buttons uh on this new keyboard i don't think those keys are like specifically laid out like that but based on what the um the thingamathing tells me is that it's got multimedia functions so you press a combination of buttons um to get these so it's basically like a laptop how like on your laptop you don't have these keys separate you have to press like they're on the f the f ones the f buttons so you would press like the function button and then the one that you want corresponding it's like that for this um yeah i like that so let me pull it out oh, it's beautiful it's pure black until i turn it on until i plug it in and turn it on um, to get the uh, the lights. So, look at it. Ah! 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 <laughs> oh my god! Oh, this is so satisfying. It's unreal how satisfying this is. Stop it! Oh my god. Okay. Can it? It can, right? Cause, yeah, it can. Oopsies, oopsies. So these on my old... Oops. Oh, these are sturdy as well. Oh, my goodness. Give me. Thank you. So the legs on my old keyboard, the ones on the left broke. Don't ask how. No absolute idea how. Oh, this is 
beautiful. Oh, love that. So this is what I was talking about, the function buttons. Okay. Oh, that's enough of me click clocking away. I am going to plug these in and come right back to you. A few moments later. <laughs> oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! <laughs> oh shoot. Okay, so I can't really... So what I did was for my wires, I had to group three, like my three main ones that I, that, um, I need to know what they do. So I've grouped my mouse, my keyboard, and a uh, sort of universal cord that I use to charge uh, my tablet and um, for my SD card reader. And that's um that's back there. Uh, and it's usually not plugged in, but they're tied together so I know which ones they are when I unplug and change things out. So I can't exactly remove my old keyboard and my old mouse from my current setup right now because the, the wires are sort of um, tabbed together. So I have to go in and cut that and then refigure everything. But, oh my god, oh my god, let me show you right freaking now, okay? Okay, you're gonna get, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, ooh. Look at that! Oh my god! Oh my god! I love that! Okay, there's a thing, that's just the keyboard. Just the keyboard, it's so pretty. And look at the mouse. It's changing colors, changing as I speak. It's just fading. I love this so much. Okay, so adjust the backlit brightness. Okay, so that's this one and down. Ah! Okay. Okay, so we've got... This is the brightest, then there's medium. Oh, you can go, okay, this is completely off. One, very, very subtle. Two, three, four. Yep, yeah, okay, there's only four. Adjust the backlight speed and breathing for breathing and stream. Okay, speed to slow down is this. I'm gonna so I'm gonna try and figure this out uh, by following these instructions. I'm not the greatest at following the instructions, but let's see. Eventually. So, pressing F and insert gives you the different kind of breathing modes, which is just how the lights move or activate on the keyboard. So this one is I think this is the snake race. Uh. FN insert and this is the left to right wave scan that oh I think this one's gonna be my favorite this is the last one dripping water ripples so when you press a key it just ah, it sends the colors all over oh, I love this this is my favorite okay this is my favorite I kind of like this one, but I also just like, I like it when it's just this, or like this, and it, it doesn't do the, um, like, the effect. This is pretty nice. This is the first one called the partition pattern, and you can speed it up and speed it down, so I think you do, yeah. So the arrow keys left and right change how fast it goes. This is left right scan. Snake race, like I said. So we can slow down snake race if we want to or speed it up. See, it's really fast now. Or we could slow it down. I think the one I'm gonna go for is not this one but this one because it does that and then we can speed it up or slow it down I think slowing it down is pretty nice oh that's beautiful so 
I think that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this random thing. <laughs> uh, I truly, I'm, I, oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> this is, oh my goodness, this is so much. There isn't much to show about the mouse besides the fact that it, 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 it glows. Like RGB. Like, I don't. Did the box say um, how I could change that? It didn't. But it's basically the same as my old one where it has like multiple keys on it. So on my old one, um, it, oh, on my old one, I can actually pull if you can see. Yeah. So on my old one, I've got these white keys on the side so on either side so these are basically like when you're in a browser or like in your win like your file explorer you press the one on your left on the left it goes back press the one on the right it goes forward and it just has like those are the only two buttons on it but this one oh it's so light as well oh my goodness it has them on it has them on oh goodness it has them both of them right here and then you've got your regular left and right click um dpi button in the middle uh and it's just it's oh it's so nice and it's rgb guys rgb wow this dpi is high god damn how do we oh there we go okay so just pressing it, it goes through the three three auto sets four auto sets so 800 1200 1600 and 3600 i think my brother's honestly i think my brother's is all the way up at 3600 on his pc it's ridiculous how fast his mouse moves and i don't understand how he keeps up i truly don't because i'll go like whenever he he calls me from work and he asks me like um can you make a game on my steam library download and i go to his pc and i touch his mouse like i don't know where the mouse the cursor gone because it just moves so fast like it literally just Touching it like that, gone, disappears. Anyways, enough of my brother's mouse sensitivity being way too high to be humanly possible to follow. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. It was very random, very strange. And I did say in my last video that um, the next one you're gonna see is a male CC shopping. And right now, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do it. So if you see me wearing the same top, I might put something over it. I don't know. If the AC turns on before then, then you know why I'm wearing something else on top. But yeah, that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please leave a like and subscribe down below. Click that notification bell so you always get notified when I post a video. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye bye!